These are all members of your community in Penticton. They all lived here in Penticton at one point in time. Penticton students paid their respects to almost 600 veterans Wednesday morning. We're doing the No Stone Left Alone program. And what that is, it's an event that brings together um, members of the Legion, uh, currently serving members of the Canadian Armed Forces, and high school or elementary or you know middle school students. Um, we all get together and we come to a cemetery and place poppies on the headstones of all the veterans that are interned in the cemetery. This is Veterans Week, so leading up to Remembrance Day, we all do the Remembrance Day ceremony, for sure, we understand that, and, and all the schools do a fantastic program in the school. And we go to the cemeteries uh, because sometimes the cemeteries are forgotten. And those soldiers that are interned, I say soldiers or airmen or crewmen, they're interned in the cemeteries, well, they need to be remembered as well. One 13-year-old girl remembered her grandpa who died almost 10 years ago while she laid a poppy down on his grave. He, he was a major in the Air Force and um, it's kind of special because I know that people like because of him, people survived. He was really, he was really nice and kind, and he, um, he loved me a lot. While the snow landed on the ground, the beautiful red poppy stood out, reminding everyone to always remember our veterans. For Castanet News, I'm Chantel Deacon in Penticton. Read letters to the editor in our letters section under the opinion button in the yellow masthead. Email your letters to letters at castanet.net.